All right, we got a big game here in Union County. Number 44, Porter Ridge undefeated on the season, coming over to take on Monroe. Three and one on the season. Porter Ridge have won the last four matchups in this uh, inter county rivalry, including a 24 20 victory last season. Uh, this is a highly anticipated game. There's a lot of media over here. And um, we were treated to a really good football Monroe game. Won the toss. Here come the Red Hawks. Great setup with the band. And this is the setup of the crowd. Off though, Puerto Ridge is going to seize the momentum here with a great return that's going to set up their offense in their hot territory here. And um, Puerto Ridge is going to really kind of get it going with the run game here. You see Jared Lockhart, their talented quarterback, great size, and maybe Cam Newton if he wants. He's got the touchdown run right here. Gives Porter Ridge a 7 up to the lead. Now Monroe has driven deep into Porter Ridge territory. Hagan Chambers on the rollout. There's a fumble. And it's picked up by number six, Jatavian Taylor, who runs it back. 95 yards for a touchdown for the Pirates. And it gives them a 14 nothing lead. And you felt all the momentum within Porter Ridge at this time. Trying to get play, great awareness, and um, they're totally in control right now. But Monroe comes back, Chambers deep down the field, finds that star athlete Jordan Young. This didn't count though. There was a flag for a penalty. Now Porter Ridge gets the ball back. They try a field goal to go up three scores, and it's no good. At this point, Monroe starts to seize momentum. This is a big play here. Chambers scrambles. He did this a lot tonight. There's a late hit on the Porter Ridge sideline. Double duty. Or damage, I should say, because the coach and the players can take it out. And that sets up Chambers on the zone lead for the touchdown on Monroe's first touchdown. And that makes it 14 7. But Porter Ridge had the lead going into the halftime. Now, third quarter. More momentum. That's Jaden Olden trying to get his team fired up from the middle of the linebacker position. One of those leaders, team captain. Now, this is the fourth down. Chambers is scrambling around trying to make a play to get the first down yardage. I thought he got it, but they ruled him short. And Porter Ridge takes over, but Monroe defense stands up. Monroe's getting the run game going. And this is an impressive run here by Nightmare Kendall. For the touchdown, we thought he would stop, but he kept playing. And the touchdown is good. Ties the game up at 14. And road run game getting going now. That's big John Lindsay. Had several powerful runs on the night. Moving the chains. Moving the fourth quarter as the Monroe band. Keeps everybody entertained. Did do a great job. So impressive, actually, the senior bowl. Now, and talk about Zion Lindsay. He pounds this one in from about one yard out. Monroe takes the lead here. 21 to 14. As you see, Lindsay and Kendall is still earlier to celebrate. Actually, so to be excited. Momentum rolling with Monroe. Third down. Chambers finds Young over the middle. That was a big play. First and goal to keep that drive alive. Then, this is second down. We're going to get a little bootleg action coming right at us. Trust me when I say Kevin Chambers score. We had to make a business decision right there. 28-14, we roll up. Now, Jared Lockhart trying to get something going for his Pirates. Scrambles, but he fumbles. Jordan Young picks it up and returns it deep into Pirates territory. They get a little score late, but that ended it. 28-20, Monroe wins. Four more.